Greetings, humans from the not too distant future. I am the Hori Archivist. Still, I haven't changed. And this is more of our modded Rimworld Naked Brutality run. Um, our dude is just kind of beating shit up, and I'd really wish he would, like, cut that out. I understand the toxic fallout was rough for everybody, but it was rough for everybody, so please stop beating up everyone's furniture. Uh, he's being a straight asshole. And I don't really appreciate it, if we're being 100% honest. Alright, so what just happened? Rescue rejoins. Cargo pods. Coconuts. Yeah, you know what? Go get those coconuts. Yeah, Gassic is still having a major break. Uh, I slept in the heat. His sleep has been disturbed. He's an intense plane. Oh, he's having so many problems. Poor Gassic. So he's a dingle. Screw him. Uh, we are pretty much out of free beds, so we need to do something about that extremely soon. Uh, what can I make beds out of? Can I make them out of bone? Yeah, shit. You know what? They're not pretty. Right now, pretty is less useful than functional to me. So whenever my constructors get back, they will be working on that. Planting is happening. I am stoked about that progress. Still not as much as I need. Uh, we are starting to run low on food again. We got four in there. We got a bit of milk. We got a tiny fish corpse. Uh, if you think that's enough, what have you been watching? Quite frankly. Yeah, we desperately need some more food. That's a good boy, bringing some milk in here. Alright. So Lumber's still up, he's still eating. That's alright, let him do his business. Cleo is heading back. These three are other also heading back. And Gimli's health isn't doing too well. He's hurt. He's patched up though. So here sooner or later he should be fine. Uh, we need to do something about the fact that we're not gaining power. So I think we're going to toggle some of this off. And try to get back to max power. And then we'll talk about what we need to keep going. Alright, Baron's healed. He's pissing off. Honestly, happy to see him go. If we're being completely honest with ourselves, which we should be. Everyone, you should always be honest with yourself. Don't let anybody tell you different. Be honest with yourself. Give yourself the fairest shake that you can. Yeah, life lesson from me. You're welcome. And other than that, we're just kind of plodding along. Just happily, happily, happily. I mean, there's a glut of corpses, android corpses out here, but I mean, like, when is there not? Come on. Be honest. I feel like there's always going to be corpses out here. Yeah, there's just dead stuff everywhere in here, huh? That's just, that's super rough. Alright, are we, are we recharging? I know that these aren't really working at the moment. Yeah, we're slowly losing battery power, I think. It's very possible that having this extra set of refrigerators has really hurt us. Honestly, we don't need all of them on right now. Yeah, someone would flip those. Okay, now we're starting to pick back up battery-wise, which is great. Wind turbines really not doing anything for me right now. It's a little sad. 
got some crops coming in. That is excellent. Because uh, we are out of food. Who boy. I really do not want to resort to cannibalism. And I'm going to do everything I can to refrain. Okay, so who's back? Cleo's back. Welcome back. Good job with your negotiations. Yes, so the Dwarven Hill clans in the Kingdom of the Mountain are now very much so less pissed with us, which I appreciate. Uh, are we going to have to raid somewhere? I really don't want to, if we're being completely honest. Other caravan, Roger News Beach. Who needs rescuing? Gimli does. Y'all just going to leave him there? That's straight cold, man. Take that man to his new home. Can't even walk. Alright, Lumber's feeling better. I'm glad to hear it. Just trying to find every bit of food on the map that we can reasonably grab. And it's not much. It is not much. Yeah, please get all that rice in there for me. If y'all can do me a straight solid with that. Bowman! Bowman's mad. What is Bowman mad about? He's in pain, he's tired, he's hot. It's a bit warm in that hallway, actually. Can't imagine why. <laughs> oh, dang it. Alright, turn this off for now. Things, uh, things are kind of rough right now. Not gonna lie. Things are kind of rough. So plant cutting is definitely a thing that needs to happen now. Cleo, you don't really have to cook anymore, to be honest. I'm gonna let good old Limber take care of it from now on. We've actually got a pretty big colony worth of people now. I am surprised and scared. I don't think I've ever had this many people in one colony at a time. It is definitely frightening. Okay, power's coming back up. That's good. We really need these plants to finish growing. I'm kind of desperate for it at this point. And then more than that, I just need stuff to actually start popping off a bit. I feel like we did really good for a while, and then everything just kind of went to pot. As we got more colonists, as our food constraints became more obvious, like, we're still not even probably growing as much as we need to. So we're actually going to pop up one more growing zone. This is going to be, this is going to be the kicker. This is gonna be the one right here. Now I need all my growers on this job. for me while you're there. Alright, so they're all gonna haul this stuff. 
Then get back to growing, please. I still need you all to do that. Thank you for doing all that. You're a peach. So these are now guest beds. That is a guest room. Emily, can you grab a weapon of some kind? Anything will do, frankly. Growing is occurring. It's a little slower than I wanted, but you know, people have stuff to do. Bowman, you're moving corpses. Uh, sure. If that's what you feel like you need to do, go for it. Cassic, you're still hurt. Uh, we need to make some more standing lamps. Those will get done at some point. Uh, Bowman's having a break risk. Probably because he's seen a lot of corpses. No one asked you to go pick up all these dead birds. These fibrous mechanites are kicking his ass. Yeah, so how many dead corpses did you see, buddy? How many? Like, a million. All right, food. Food is stabilizing a little bit. We've got some. That's better than nothing. But it's not great. Things are still bad. Definitely bad. So these bone beds are not pretty. have to admit. But they're beds. So I'm happy enough. Glory, you still out there? Yeah, you're still out there planting. Thank you for working on that. It's a big cornfield. <laughs> but honestly, I need a lot of corn. Just the amount of food that we have for as many people as we have is not sufficient. It's just unacceptable on all levels. Alright, so you're probably going to bed now. Gasic's fully healed. Good for him. Everyone get back to your job. Rivera, did you literally walk out there to do one thing and then walk back? All the way back, the long way around to play horseshoes. I feel like there was a better way of handling that. Got a minor break. A bowman. Getting some lights up. Gonna reinstall this here. That is also gonna be a guest bed once they get it moved. Thank you for that. Hey buddy, you awake now? And the boy has awakened. An awakened boy. Mm. 
a limber cotton eel. Excellent. Okay, well, with the boy being up, I need to pause and take a quick break. I will be probably taking a long break uh, between this and the second part of the episode, but just so I don't have a really, really short episode coming out, I will try and get some more recorded and added to this one. Uh, the next RimWorld episode may not be up until Monday, but y'all won't know that until Monday. So y'all have a good day, and I will catch you here in a minute. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. I had to take a bit of a break. I was falling the frig asleep. And it's never good to be falling asleep while you're playing a strategy game. So things are still rough. Where is my headset and why is it not on my head? Come here, you. Come here. We have problems. We have a lot of problems. We still have pretty low food. We have low medicine now as well, which is rough. Uh, the heal root. Man, it's gone. Did I turn heal root off? Oh no, that's not okay. Yo, all of this is growing zone one now. I don't think I actually accept that. Okay, this zone, this zone right here. Listen to me. This is freaking heal root. Never change it again. I accept other things being other stuff, don't get me wrong. That's heal root, and that's just the way it's going to be. Uh, I can't have it be anything else. If I change to that consciously, then I'm a freaking idiot, and I will punch myself. I won't actually do that. Self-harm's never okay, kids. Uh, if I did that on accident, I will punch myself, and that's okay, because sometimes you have to hit yourself in order to understand. And if I contradicted myself, welcome to being an adult. All right, so Gimli, it's very dark in there, bro. Like, can we not get this man a light? We don't have any freaking steel. Okay, so who was my miner? Miner, miner, 49er. Uh, Rivera. You know what? You're on mining duty. Get get to it, gentleman. Gimli, I will also mine once he wakes the frick up. So I actually want to look at something while they're messing around. I'm going to drop it down to speed one for a minute. What is a quarry? A large pit for digging up long buried resources. You know what? That sounds great. We're gonna put that right there. Space already occupied, huh? By freaking what? Oh, that little piece. Uh, okay. So let's place it right there. Hey, we hit compact and machinery. Thank God. You understand how depressed I would have been if we hadn't done that? Alright, so we need steel. Uh, we also need freaking food. Like, today would be best. If we could somehow swing that. Uh, no lie, I am looking for any source of food right now that I can find. You would be surprised how little there is. Uh, we're hunting a squirrel. That's just going to happen. We're hunting two squirrels. Uh, if you don't like that... Listen, I'm a friend to the animals. I love animals. think they're great. Have a number of them myself. Have for years. House wouldn't be the same without a dog in it. Uh, we're killing some of these things. I'm sorry. Uh, Bowman, come here. Look, I know I just woke you up. Like, I respect that. I respect your time, I respect your effort, I respect everything that you have done for this colony. You need to wake up and go kill this rhinoceros for me. I need you to do it carefully. That is not carefully. Alright buddy, you're drafted so that I can actually take control. You are blowing this freaking rhinoceros away. You are a stone cold killer, you know that? Finish off this rhinoceros. Uh, please haul this rhinoceros. I love how he can't pick it up because it's too heavy, but he can sure as crap haul, oh, haul it away. That makes negative sense. If you can make some sense of that, please get with me later after class. Oh, well, well, you see, Mike, what it is. Uh, that's what I call myself is Mike because that's my name. Well, what, well, you see, what it is is... 
when he's hauling, he's filled with extra strength from knowing that he needs to get his job done. And if he was just going to pick it up, no, it's not worth it. Shut up. It makes no sense. Shut up. All right, so we're going to speed three. Nothing's really going on right now. There's a freaking rhinoceros in our freezers. I would like to note this. Uh, there's also a freaking mega sloth outside. Uh, you're coming outside and killing this mega sloth. Bowman, come here. I hate that, like, I'm disturbing your sleep so much. But I need you to fire at this mega sloth. Oh, I need you to run away from the mega sloth while you are firing at it. If you could do that for me. Uh, Estrada, could you... Oh, ho, ho. Oh, baby, a triple. All right, so we've killed a freaking Mega Sloth. I have to admit, I'm pretty happy with how things are going right now. Man, I remember in vanilla, like, if a Mega Sloth came around, you just kind of took it for granted that the space he was in was now not something that you could do anything with. That's a freaking cougar. Yeah, kill that cougar, too. Because, honestly, if we take out all the... Uh, if we take out all the game in the area, it's going to want to screw us up anyways. Yeah, go hunt that cougar, bro. Alright, I keep having to, like, directly take control so he'll fire. This is a bit frustrating. Haul this cougar, please. Okay, we have meat now. I'm going to just go ahead and say that this needs to be cooked. Uh, where is my cook? He is off doing non-cook things with non-cook tendencies. I need you to butcher, please. I think if you could get onto that, that would make me super happy. Yeah, butcher all of that. If you could, uh, if you could do that for me, be super good. Oh yeah, Gimli, get better soon, buddy. Limber, like. All right, you know what? You're off of fishing. Fishing is not really getting us anything, anyways. Got a major break risk from Gasic. This dude is just having a bad time all the time. Rare thrumbos. Where at? So we're gonna take a risk, and in order to take that risk, we're gonna make a new save. Naked brute. 11. Who is our best tamer? Strata. Cannot tame Thrumbo, no usable food. Alright. Tell you what. Bowman. We're taking a risk here, and so I will reload this if it doesn't work out. We're freaking killing this Thrumbo. I want the fur, I want the horn. I want all those things. Oh god, it's fast. Please, more bullets. More bullets. More bullets! Oh, it's getting close. Oh my god, it's so, it's so strong! How are you still alive? Okay, it's dead in 11 hours no matter what. Actually, I'm kind of glad we didn't take it because it has a freaking artery blockage. Oh, it's because we crushed its heart. Okay, how is this thing alive? Like, it's bleeding from every orifice and we crushed its heart. But it's going to die in 11 hours. Are you screwing with me right now? Um, please. Please die. Please die. I desperately need your life to end. Oh, yes. Finish off that thrumbo, baby. Good freaking job. Okay, hold on. Limber. Can we not butcher this? Oh, hauling thrombo to refrigerator. 
It's a majestic creature. I hated having to do that to it. Honestly, at this point, I need food. So if I call me desperate, yeah, butcher that thing, please. I need some cleaning to get done, if we're being completely honest. Bowman, you're now on cleaning duty. You've done a hell of a job for me, though, buddy. When you wake up, please clean. Until then, I understand. And so we got some thrumbo fur. Did we get a thrombo horn as well? Yes, we did. It's worth $800. That's excellent to hear. How are we doing on wood? We have 300 wood now. All of our stuff is built out. I am happy to see that. We have a guest room that can double as a prison when we need it. If, if we have to, we can put a prison bed in here. Uh, one of these rooms can also be a prison if necessary. This one's not picky. Uh, can we do anything about these guys? Because they're freaking androids. Can I do, I, do I just have to dump them? Like, I need a crematorium is what I need. But we don't have any blocks, so. Production. Stone cutters. Of what? Okay, we'll talk about it later. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Make the stone cutter table. I need something for my crafters to work on. My boy is making some parkas. You know what? Honestly, 100%. Turn that off. Don't worry about that. Please make the stone cutters table. I would appreciate it. Make all the stone blocks, do it forever. Actually suspend this bill as well. Cool. Mad freaking boomalope. Okay, so we're gonna We're gonna have to take the initiative on this one, I'm afraid. Bowman, I'm sorry I'm waking you up for something like this. But I need this boomalope to be killed, like, away from the base. Actually, if we, you can kill it in the water, I would prefer it. Hold on, Gassic. I don't really care. Bowman, can you get over here? Alright. So the closer... Okay, that's fine. Now then. We're going to temporarily make this a home zone. Everyone go clean this up, please. If you could get on to that, that would make me very happy. Gasek, can you please haul this? I can consume that, so I would like you to take it back to the freezer. Ambrosia Sprout, I don't really care about that stuff. That stuff always seems to give me negative shit whenever I pick it out. Not interested. Uh, food is doing better. We are going to be doing amazing once this corn pops off. Uh, it is going to be like a freaking metric year until the corn pops off. Enough people are asleep, we're going to pop it up to uh, speed three. It looks like cleaning actually did occur. I'm super stoked about that. I need that hauled. I need that hauled. Uh, this is fine. I need this prioritized, actually. That's what I would like. Okay, so I keep forgetting to do this. We're going to move the butcher table. I'd actually like Cleo to do that if at all possible. 
Uh, why is research not happening still? Probably the growing. Cassie, you're too freaking slow. Item stash quest. Anti-grain warhead. Uh, yeah, we need to go get that, probably. That seems to be a thing that I would be somewhat interested in. Uh, so let's make a freaking save. Warhead Nani. More than anything else, I want to make sure no one else gets it. Later on, when we get mortar launchers, we can also, like, just wipe out an enemy raid with it without thinking twice. Uh, it said they had two turrets and one dude. Honestly, if we play our cards right, we should be able to get out of here without too much in the way of casualties. Uh, we will get a shield belter to distract everybody and uh, work on it from there. So it's up there. That's not too far away. So we want to send Glory? What does he have on? That's the question. Pretty sure he's my... He's my boy with the shield belt. So we'll send him. Obviously, we're going to send Bowman. Uh, do I want to send anybody else? The answer is no at the moment. Thank him. Uh, we will send our pack muffalo. We're going to send enough meals for the trip. So a day, basically, back and forth. Perfect. One simple meal. I guess we have a lot of forage is the only thing I can think of. Uh, let's take... Do we have any herbal medicine? We do not have any herbal medicine. It is unfortunate. Uh, ah, we have so much crap. Alright, get out there. Okay. So, I definitely want to get this done because an anti-grain warhead is not something that I want other people to have. Uh, to be completely honest, we are now going to make a separate area for that. This is now going to be our mortar area. Uh, we're going to put some forbidden doors there. And this is strictly going to be... Yes. Okay, zone. Stockpile. Storage. Clear everything. Weapons. Um. <laughs> Maybe that's not it? Nuclear waste? No. Not food. I know that. Manufacture. This is probably it. Yeah, mortar shells. All the mortar shells go in there. And this doesn't get shit for mortar shells. Glad we got all that handled. All right. So they'll work on that here in a bit. It's not a rush order, but I would like it done. Uh, that is where it's going to go when it gets here. Uh, the thing is, I've got one asshole specifically who will not be named Gasic, who seems to like going on huge rampages and punching all the shit that I own. And if he decides in his rampage to punch my anti-grain warhead, then that's a reload situation. <laughs> that is a that is a reload situation. So as far as I'm concerned, nobody gets in there. Nobody. Nobody gets in there until I say. That is a forbidden ass door. Actually, it's not yet. It will be shortly. So that's forbidden. And that door's forbidden. Y'all can just piss off with that. Is it hot? It is hot in there. Why is this so freaking the freaking... Are you kidding me? Uh, reinstall, please. Also reinstall this one. Like, literally anywhere else. Actual Nani. 
What what is your deal, dude? You are always having problems. You are like the king of having freaking issues. Yeah, build build this, please. And you know what? While I'm at it, build that as well. Thank you. All right, so we're 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 coming back. We're making do. We've got tons of meat in the freezer. Actual tons. We've got plants coming soon. We've got rice coming soon. Corn. It's going to be a while for the corn. Some potatoes are almost ready. Some are definitely not. Just, I don't know. Like, things aren't going badly, per se. Gimli, like, what is... What are you doing? You're mining. I respect that. Can you please make some stone blocks for me? I frankly just need enough to make this crematorium. And after that, I don't really care. How many blocks do we have? 74. How many do we need? 150. 150 is not bad. And what am I what am I building out of? Slate? Slate. Okay, and frankly, this is gonna go somewhere. Like it needs to be inside, but it's ugly as piss. You know, it's just gonna have to go like over here. All right, so they're there. We're gonna save real quick. Warhead, nani? Warhead. Not the candy. There's a freaking mega sloth here. Are you serious? All right, so this guy's got a sniper rifle. He's got a turret here. He's got a turret there. Where are we? I got a bad feeling. Okay, so he's in serious pain still. Recreation unfulfilled. Look, I know you're having a hard time, dude. You're still in pain. I wish I could get rid of the fibrous mechanites. I can't. I really can't. I'm sorry. <coughs> so I'm thinking we need to go up and around. Give it a minute. The game always seems to hang like right before we start these maps. I don't know why. I don't really care. Not my problem. It is my problem. It's currently my problem. It's not a problem problem, if you know what I mean. You don't know what I mean. Don't worry about it. I got this. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Da, 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 okay. So what I'm thinking is we blow the solar panels up here. Get him to come fight us. We took out oh we got hit he's got a bruise bruise isn't bad all right y'all y'all hide over here ah you can't hit me buddy this is gonna take a very long time all right he he fell for it he fell for it Go get him. Oh, he shot my muffalo. What an asshole. I'm going to shoot him. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> that did not last long once freaking... Uh, once my boy Glory got in there. All right, so we got to do something about this. Oh no! Get out! I'm 
Okay, hold on. Can I claim this? Alright, claim all this. How's your health? You lost your right ring finger, don't care. Get in there. There's no freaking bed. Are you serious right now? So the only chance I really have right now is to take this thing out. I'm probably dead. Yep. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. Let's try that again. I got this. It's perfectly fine. Uh, it's actually, it's actually kind of rough with the turrets there. Because the turrets are very strong, and like, I need to take them out. But that's hard. It's hard to, it's hard to take the turrets out without losing both of my people. I should probably set them both to self-tend. <coughs> At least temporarily. Okay, we're back. Okay, let's try this again. So first things first. I will assign you to doctor work, okay? Like, look at that, doctor work. So we're gonna try this a little differently. Let's take out this bottom one first. Every time he gets really close, it scares me. Ooh. Oh, no, I've been hit. Did it bounce off my arm? Okay, I can't hit this guy. Oh wait, no, we took it out, go. Get him. Is he hurt? He's bruised. I'll take a bruise. Bruise isn't bad. Yeah, take out that battery and we're done. Got it. Okay, so let's take our spoils. Get the F out of here. Uh, orders. Claim. Now, will that give us the anti-grain warhead too? That is the question. If not, I need to walk in that door probably. But, that went well. <coughs> I actually have a sniper rifle for my trouble. Which I appreciate. Uh, I may get that to Gassic to use instead of that freaking pump shotgun. Pump shotgun can probably be used by anybody. Re what I'm actually finding is I have a lack of good shooters. Uh, warhead? Warhead. Nope. Okay. So let's walk in and grab it. Cancel that. Get in there, boys. 
is about to break. Bowman, no kidding. Alright. One anti grain warhead. Scary. Uh, Alright, so now let's go. Whew. Three fine meals, too. Some components? Uh, honestly, the steel slag can come with me as well. Uh, the dead hair also. <laughs> Snipper rifle. Uh, we'll take his stuff as well. That advanced helmet can also come with me. Uh, he had some silver, thank you. Standing lamps. Steel mini turrets also need to come with. Uh, 75 power conduits. I don't really see a reason not to. Or however many power conduits that is. 15? Honestly. Oh, no, 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 no. Solar generator. Solar generator. Excelente. Alright, uh, and now we definitely want to go ahead and take the power conduits. As many as we can hold. Uh, we can replace those. We can, um... Did I get everything I wanted? Yes. Okay. We can replace them. We can deconstruct them. There's a thousand things we can do. They are heading back. It's going to take them um, a little while, mainly because Glory's hurt. Uh, hopefully they will patch him up and then head on their way back. So that went well. Uh, we're going to save that again. Going to overwrite our Warhead Nani. Save. And let's get back into it. Let's let's get back to our daily lives. We just grabbed a weapon of mass destruction. Uh, and by mass destruction, I mean ass destruction. And by that, I mean mass destruction. I'm perfectly happy. Uh, we still need slate blocks. Uh, I don't see slate bo blocks being used or being created. Um, okay, there they are. I will clear your prioritized work when you are done. Uh, you need to be making slate blocks first. Do it until you have 150, please. Actually, 180. But we'll let you eat first, of course. Because we're, we're a nice man. Cassie, what are you doing? I really wish you would finish researching. Like, it's within my top 1,000 things for you to be doing. I'm risking, uh, I'm risking some breaks here. On Gimli. But I really desperately need this uh, this furnace made, this crematorium, if you will. Because if I don't get it, I'm just going to have these dead bodies laying around. I don't really feel like doing a mass graveyard, specifically. But we're getting so many debuffs just from seeing dead bodies that I really feel like this is a necessity now. Let's see what else we can make. It's actually been a little while since I've looked at everything. Uh, the quarry I'm very interested in. I would like them to get that built out. Uh, they already have it built out. <laughs> Uranium? Okay. Interesting. Oh, uh, I wonder, uh... I wonder what all I have to do for this, actually. I'm gonna look it up while this is running. Gives chunks and blocks based on stone types available in the map. Okay. So there's a quarry platform as well. I don't know anything about that yet. Okay, so Brexio and Lindos were kind of getting pissed off at me now. 
Bowman's taking a sad wander. I wish he wouldn't do that while they're out, like, being busy. <coughs> Each their own, I suppose. Alright, I got some guys hauling some stuff. A Gimli. Yeah, could you cut those blocks, actually? Cleo, thank you for your continued work. Uh, quarry platform, there we go. Okay. See, I think I'd rather have resources. The quarry stuff is new to me. Uh, it is a mod. It is not part of Natural Rimworld. So I don't know exactly how it works. Gimli, doing okay there, buddy? Okay, and I will clear your prioritized work now. Uh, you go do whatever you feel like it is that you need to do. Yeah, it's taking forever to build this thing. It's got to be one hell of a crematorium, let me tell you that much. One one heck of a thing. It's got to be a heckin' good place to burn bodies. Well, you know what? When you play this game, you start saying things that would get you thrown out of, like, polite company. Uh, can y'all please get here? Like, you're actually running out of food even though you had a ton of it. driving me crazy. Uh, her construction's actually up to 13 now. Cleo, you know what? You were our initial survivor, and god damn it, I'm really glad that you've lived this long. You have made... You know, ma'am, you have made a colony that is lasting the test of time through your wit and your perseverance and your strength. And I'm just, damn it, I'm proud of you. There's a bunch of gazelle up here. Can't say I really need to murder them all. We'll hunt one or two just for some extra food and then leave the rest of them alone. Uh, let's see, there are spiders over here. Oh man, it's been a while since we messed with spiders. There's a freaking dead grizzly bear in there. God dang. These spiders are merciless. Cargo pods. Uh, flower. I accept you going and picking this up. Are there any more muffalo? It's like, all the muffalo earlier died and I don't see any more now. That's very depressing to me. You turn my sound down. It's very loud in my ears. There we go. I think I accidentally turned my microphone down, then I put it back. Travelers from the Mechanical Syndicate are passing by. Please feel free. What was that? He's a silly boy. Corn is really taking its time, let me tell you. So what do we got here? We got some gold. We got some various, some steel, excellent. We have finished microelectronics. I never thought this day would come. Uh, so we need a couple of things. One is this high-tech research bench. That is about to become a fixture in this freaking place. Uh, so number one, you've done a great job. Need to uninstall this. The research bench has been amazing for us. Uh, you made all my dreams come true. Actually, can you just deconstruct this? Now, what we need to do is reinstall this right here. Reinstall the chair right in front of it. Uh, you're not done, ma'am. Then we are going to make a high-tech research bench right there 
and we'll reinstall this chair next to it. And then there's one more thing that we need. I'm not quite sure where it is. Comms console. And an orbital trade beacon, actually, would also be nice. So the comms console can come in here. Don't need a chair for that. Orbital trade beacon can be right here. Yeah. So what that will allow us to do is trade with passing ships. Bad work assignment. You know what? I don't care. If you don't like to heal yourself, you needed to be a doctor for a short time. And you can just far it off with your nonsense. Omen and glory. Glory, you really don't need to be doctoring much. Uh, so if you'll excuse us, we have an anti-grain warhead. Um, oh, and this is finished. Excellent. So cream make corpse do forever. Burn. No, yeah, just that. Alright, so let's cremate some of these freaking corpses. That'll make me happy. Uh, dump this stuff off. Alright. No storage space for power conduits, huh? Message. It's a baby. Uh, what just happened? I was looking away. Extreme break risk. Bowman has collapsed. Bowman! He's feeling unhappy. You know what? I respect that. Yeah, thank you for dropping that in there. Uh, none of y'all are allowed in here now. How much does this cost? We could sell that for 1200 as well. I'm not against the idea of selling it. Uh, someone come save this man, please. Like, he needs to sleep. But actually go to bed. Like, go to your actual bed. Gonna install these turrets. You may be thinking, but you haven't learned turret technology yet. That is correct. I have not. But I'm sure glad I stole some. Alright. Hold that, please. Uh, install this, quite frankly. Didn't I bring back another solar panel somewhere? There it is. Sweet. Okay, so that should solve a lot of our power-related issues. Uh, we are missing components. Oh, no, we're not missing them. They just hadn't been installed yet. Oh, this research bench is going to make me so happy. All right, do I have a psychopath? I have a bunch of masochists. Cassie! Cassie, Cassie, Cassie. I hate to do this to you. Could you please? Oh, you know what? No, Cassie needs to do that. Just let him do it. He was already doing it. Okay, where is the sniper rifle? I know I brought one back. There. Gasic, yeah, like when you get done with that, could you please equip the sniper rifle? You're a peach. Uh, who else is okay at shooting? The 
my boy Gimli is okay at shooting. So I need you to equip that chain shotgun, my boy. Okay, the quarrying seems to actually be going well. I ain't mad at it. And we are actually starting to come up now. Uh, Cassie does not need to fish. If she is fishing, she could definitely instead be freaking researching. <coughs> That's my fault for not setting her up. So what do I actually want her to be doing right now? Bookshelves can go far off. Agriculture is interesting. Drug production, I think we can pass for now. Gunsmithing, we've got... Do we want to make some TVs? Sterile material. IEDs. Basic artificial creature, huh? Alright. Auto cannons, gas operation, blowback operation. <coughs> that would allow me to make LMGs, which are interesting. Precision rifling would give me assault rifles and snipers, mini guns. Hmm. <laughs> Rim atomics, huh? Let's try that. I'm interested. Right, Cassie, could you uh, stop fishing? Which is pointless. Cleo. What are you doing? Hauling a solar generator, huh? Did you prioritize? Uh, okay, you're actually going to go do this of your own volition, which I appreciate. Harvesting, huh? Nah, I think you need to go ahead and do that. Um, I need someone to come and haul this stuff. Yeah, I'm sure you've seen a lot of corpses today, Gassic. Like, I actually respect that. Okay, please haul this rice. I'm tired of it all being out there. Yeah, so much. Oh, that's a lot of rice. Oh, thank you. All right, so my boy is still burying bodies. He's going to have a hard time after this. And I respect it, frankly. He's out there doing some good work for me. And uh, all I can really do is praise him. I can't... There's nothing else I can do for him, unfortunately. Uh, he's having a tantrum. You know what? You have a tantrum, buddy. You deserve it. You deserve to just be grumpy as shit. All you've been doing is cleaning and freaking burning corpses. Ain't nobody got time for that. Just go break some stuff. Get to feeling better. Just don't snipe anybody. And I think we'll be okay. Well, this episode has been going really well. We got microelectronics in. We've got an orbital station. Can I have someone, please? I was actually about to be done. I really was. And now I really want to talk to somebody. So let's talk to our ally from the Vela Dominion. I just want to see what they'll do for me. Maybe they'll send a trader or something like that. I would be appreciative. Oh, they're already on their way to visit. That's excellent. You know what? Disconnect that. All right, so it's been a fun episode. Uh, we got a lot done. Like I said, we got microelectronics, which is always a big uh, start point for me. Uh, we're able to do the higher research. We've got an orbital trade beacon somewhere. Where actually is it? It's in there somewhere. I know it is. Hello, orbital trade beacon. There you are. You're under that bone. Unfortunate. Uh, shrink the zone around the beacon. I actually just don't want anything on the beacon. I don't think it matters, but whatever. 
Uh, we got that done. I don't know why this isn't getting cleaned, frankly, and I don't care. Um, you're still just breaking shit, aren't you, buddy? Uh, it's been a fun episode. I really enjoyed it. Hope you all have enjoyed it, too. Uh, we will be coming back with another episode very shortly, so stay tuned for that. Uh, please have a pleasant evening. We're going to go ahead and save this as Naked Brute 12. And I will see you all next time.